all right so we're gonna Should jump right into this i am doing some spongebob nails theme nails duck nail tips doing the pop-off method as you can see so use top coat and use cuticle oil that's how i do mine so it can pop off and as y'all can see i'm gluing over duck nail tips onto another nail tip i already had um i just cut that one down blending in the tips and i am going to cut down the duck nail tips it just looked better to me when i cut it down just a little bit so i'm just blending that tip in as well and like that looked better to me so we're gonna do it like that this blue i use terrible it was chalky it was terrible so i'm really about to go over it i got this color from sugar and cream by far my favorite acrylic line um i don't even know what the color called i put it in the description box but so we just gonna change the colors up i did have an idea but we're gonna change them now so i'm doing this color and i'm gonna do some hot pink glitter and yeah we're about to just dug it out with that so just quick applications of me quick videos of me doing my application um this nail i did kind of mess up on but you're gonna see me fix it i, I used too much of the pink it was it, it was a little bit of a mess but you can always fix that and y'all can see i'm gonna fix that and we're gonna do some fish scales um i got these little fish scale nets years ago like two three years ago i don't even remember from where probably glitz and glamour not like glitz and glamour nail supply glamour but that's how they come out loved it so now i'm about to just do this aura nail because i do not have an airbrush machine mine's broke so we're about to just do it like this it still was cute i still liked it and these the colors application quick little filing videos you know we skip past this and we get straight to the designs now for the designs i wasn't able to record step by step i got this nail drill bit, uh nail drill bit from sheen um it's the five and one um nail drill bit i want to see how it works I didn't use it for my whole set just because it wasn't as um, coarse, I guess, as I wanted it to be. Like, when it comes to my fine nail drill bits, and when it comes to selling my cuticles, I do prefer a more coarse drill bit. Um, that's just me. So, it was good. It worked. Um, it just wasn't. This is really good for a beginner, though, as well. So, if you are a beginner, this is perfect for you. Um, I just needed something a little bit more fire underneath it so this is how it looked i did switch the nail drill bits and now you're just about to see me um curve out the little flowers i do sketch everything out that's just me i have to i have to sketch everything out with a pencil and just go over it for the most part oh but so like i was saying i couldn't record step by step because y'all need I have to keep looking at my phone like i'm still new to drawing i'm still new to nail art when I, mean, I nail art but a hand drawing and stuff and i still have to look at the pictures detail by detail and so i couldn't keep i couldn't like think about it in my memory and then keep drawing like i had to keep looking at the picture for certain parts so i couldn't record them but i'm definitely going to keep doing like this little spongebob thing because i'm gonna do um mr crabs next with the money and all of that and i'm probably just gonna print off a picture just because i want y'all to be able to see it step by step but i had to keep looking at my phone to keep looking at the pictures of it and I only got one phone so but i need two phones for sure because i couldn't even have it as long as i wanted to have because y'all know i never got no storage i'm always complaining about that so i still be trying to get these videos out but they can't be that long so right here we're just working on his antennas um plankton was not the color he normally is girl i didn't have the color so we had just have to make it work and drawing plankton though is not hard at all i really thought it was going to be way harder than what it actually was not difficult at all like at all if y'all really want to draw a plankton like get into hand drawing and all that stuff and you're a beginner like me but start off with plankton it's not hard at all so now on this now i'm just drawing jellyfishes and now i'm just outlining it um y'all gonna see me actually draw the jellyfish as well uh it wasn't difficult either they weren't perfect but Play some jellyfish to me so yeah i was cool with it um the little white circle thingies are my bubbles yeah and y'all can see how easy that was to draw little jellyfishes so now i'm just about to show you how to do the, like the pink outline of it big round circle half circle and then i just do my little drip drop thingies and that's really it and you make it look like a jellyfish with the black um 
outline like you like you see me do the first time so now i'm about to draw a plankton wife i forgot my sister's name but i'm about to draw her and i had a hard time at first trying to figure out how to do like a little dimension square and as y'all can see y'all i couldn't record the rest of it. i had to look at the picture but it's how they came out love zones how they look on my hands they were everything to me let me know what y'all think in the comments what y'all want me to draw next